Uh, uh, uh. Oh, man. Uh, 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 uh. All my haters be watching. They watching, they watching, they watching. They see the way I be popping. No stopping me. I'm turned up like a rocket. A rocket, a rocket, a rocket. Dripping like I'm a faucet. Got options. Damn. Tell them haters to watch it. Watch it. Sit in the front and talk shit that motivates me. What's good, YouTube? We back at it with another one. You saying? I reached out to some homies on uh Facebook. You know what I'm saying? And I asked if anybody had any um new music videos that we could do reaction to. I don't got my brother here today. But um today, you know what I'm saying, I'm just gonna knock a few out myself. Um shout out to the people that responded. Shout out to people that reach out. I'm gonna get my own opinion about it. And we're gonna get to it. Um hey thank you if you haven't yet make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notification, you know notification. Gang 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 Okay, this is what we're gonna do today. The first video that we're gonna start with. Hold on, let me get the screen record going. And the first video we're gonna be going to is Ken Griffin. Lincoln uh, supposedly fought the Civil War to solve the race problem, and the problem is still here. Another white man named Lincoln, again, the same white man, issued the Emancipation Proclamation to solve the race problem, and the problem is still here. Some more white liberals came along with the 13th, 14th, and 5th Amendments, which were, which were supposed to solve the race problem, and the problem is still here. Uh, nine years ago... Free slave. I am King Griffin. What if slavery actually worked? No, hear me out. What if you've been a slave since birth? Truthfully, the very thought of this theory is eerie. I mean, I wrote this knowingly and fearing that no one would want to hear me, but I took the blinders off my third eye and even Vizine couldn't help me see more clearly. Hey, first off, I want to say, <clears throat> shout out to Griff, you know what I'm saying? Just one of my homies. Like, he was there from the start, you know what I'm saying? Like, of me learning how to record myself in those dorm room days, we, we did a, a song a long time ago. And to see that the progression of his music is is crazy. And then nothing just, it's, it's just amazing because, bro, you ain't even have to do anything like this. And knowingly doing something like this, you was going to step on some toes and you still did it. So I, I appreciate that. I think that's dope, bro. I think that's, hey, shout out to you for that. I mean, this shit is so complex, it's double back to simplicity. American nice man's dress is serendipity. I mean, back in the- And I like how you incorporate like real life videos, footage, like real life foot to show that this this is actually an issue that's going on right now. And we, we as people, we, we tend to try to shoo away from these type of things because we don't want people to really see the real that's going on sometimes so man man days when we were still called slaves we had to wake up early to break our backs all day get beat mistreated and backstabbed in your face and if that wasn't enough we did it all without pay not to mention they kill niggas every day well these days ain't much shit changed we still out here breaking our backs only to retire the canes million dollar workers getting paid minimum wage change in layman terms, we still ain't making a damn thing. We still out here screaming for change. We still get killed for not doing a damn thing. And our only resistance is marching. Some shit just never changed. So again, I'm asking, what if slavery actually worked? What if I controlled everything you believe since birth? What if I used my knowledge as power and tried to control the earth? What if I took your fathers and then told you it's because your people were cursed? By this point, I'm hoping things are starting to become clear. In order to control you, then I must first introduce fear. So I take your father and I split it from ear to ear. Right in front of you, I'm talking so close that when he cries, you get showered with tears. These days, I inflict that same fear while you sit in your chair. I'm talking camera so close, you feel like you're actually there. 
Replay it again and again until you start to see the picture. When the verdict reads not guilty, it's when the field finally hits you. By this time, all you wanna be is slaves. I meant to say by this time, all you wanna be is saved. So I sold my picture of a savior into your brain and say I protect you with my warm and grace. Condemn your beliefs and explain that you've been practicing the wrong things. Now every Sunday you tell people how I'm the king of kings. Now what that narrative displayed is how you make free slaves. The will of list theory is still being applied to this day. This enlightenment is hard aching at times. When you speak your own beliefs, people tend to say that you're out of your mind. Either that or they tell you they're out of line. I am guess I'm wasting my time. I guess I was supposed to remain confined. I was supposed to believe the lies. I wasn't supposed to read the designs of the puppet master behind the curtain. I guess I'm supposed to live my entire life with no purpose. I'm supposed to go to school and learn nothing about your financial systems. Follow the wrong crowds, never become an individual. Conceive goals of materialism and forget anything spiritual. Only have aspirations of rapping up, making a ball dribble, never learning the law, but then control with a judicial system that's set up to put my people back in prison. Put back in a chains, now you're paying your debt to society by making our products. The cheaper the labor, the better the profits, where the slavery actually work. What if you've been a slave since birth? What if I loosen up the chains? What if I took a few house niggas and I gave them everything? What if I gave them the fortune and the fame? What if I put them on TV to show off everything? Better yet, what if I told you you could do the same thing? Just do as I say and you'll never need to complain. Help me to get more of your people to sell out. There's no limit to how much you can gain. Then kill any leader who proceeds to interrupt my reign. Make true knowledge hard to obtain. Put out a force to keep laws maintained. Tell you the voters if your opinion meant a thing. What if I made my slaves feel free? I could control everything if I took the chains off your necks and put them on your brain. Man. Now that was deep. That was deep. Um, that was real thought provoking, man. <sighs> the reality of what, what if we are really still just slay? Dang, girl. <laughs> like, I, I'm, I'm never really in a loss of words, but to think about it, it's, this is this stuff that I think about all the time. Like, so, so to really just hear it, somebody put it together, and I'm. A lot of people don't know this. I'm, I'm big on, on battle rap, and I'm big on spoken word. So when it's put into, to a beat, you know what I'm saying, the music. I'm big on that because I'm, I'm big on wordplay. But that's the true definition of being lyrical. Thought provoking. What if? You know what I'm saying? And, and it's and I love stuff like this because I like I said I think about it all the time. Like, why is it why they make it okay for us to only play sports and do music? But I I love music, so it's like it's a tug war. Am I wrong for loving music? Is it is it because they they perverted the sound? They took the pureness out of it. Am I wrong? Because I understand, like, the business has made us, like like Kanye said, <laughs> they make us love their wealth. You know what I'm saying? Hate ourselves, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's crazy. Because what if we are still a slave? Comment down low. Tell me what y'all think about it. Damn, that's real. Till next time. What if we slide? What if we really Million dollar workers getting paid minimum wage change. In layman terms, we still ain't making a damn thing. We still out here screaming for change. We still getting killed for not doing a damn thing. And our only resistance is marching. So shit just never changed. So again, I'm asking. What if slavery actually worked? What if I controlled everything you believe since birth? What if I used my knowledge as power and tried to control the earth? What if I took your fathers and then told you it's because your people were cursed? By this point, I'm hoping things are starting to become clear. In order to control you, then I must first introduce fear. So I take your father and I split it from ear to ear. Right in front of you, I'm talking so close that when he cries, you get showered with tears. These days, I afflict that same fear while you're sitting in your chair. 
I'm talking camera so close you feel like you're actually there. Replay it again and again until you start to see the picture. When the verdict reads not guilty, that's when the feel finally hits you. By this time, all you want to be is slaves. I meant to say, by this time, all you want to be is saved. So I sold my picture of a savior into your brain and say, I protect you with my warm and grace. Condemn your beliefs and explain that you've been practicing the wrong things. Now every Sunday you tell people how I'm the king of kings. Now what that narrative displayed is how you make free slaves. The will of Lynch theory is still being applied to this day. This enlightenment is heartaching at times. When you speak your own beliefs, people tend to say that you're out of your mind. You Either that or they tell you they're out of line. I'm guessing I'm wasting my time. I guess I was supposed to remain confined. I was supposed to believe the lies. I wasn't supposed to read the designs of the puppet master behind the curtain. I guess I'm supposed to live my entire life with no purpose. I'm supposed to go to school and learn nothing about your financial systems. Follow the wrong cries, never become an individual. Conceive goals of materialism and forget anything spiritual. Only have aspirations of rapping up, making a ball dribble, never learning the law, but then control with a judicial system that's set up to put my people back in prison. Put back in a change, now you're paying your debt to society by making our products. The cheaper the labor, the better the profits, where the slavery actually work. What if you've been a slave since birth? What if I loosen up the chains? What if I took a few house niggas and I gave them everything? What if I gave them the fortune and the fame? What if I put them on TV to show off everything? Better yet, what if I told you you could do the same thing? Just do as I say and you'll never need to complain. Help me to get more of your people to sell out. There's no limit to how much you can gain. Then kill any leader who proceeds to interrupt my reign. Make true knowledge hard to obtain. Put out a force to keep laws maintained. Tell you the voters if your opinion meant a thing. What if I made my slaves feel free? I could control everything if I took the chains off your necks and put them on your brain.